Fucking life lessons, right? No. No. Mom, I'm not gonna say it. You know I've been pulling my own way around here since I've been 13. All right. I guess I guess you don't realize it, but maybe, maybe, I'd like to have a real life, a normal life outside of work, study, and school. Hmm. Maybe go out where I'm not riding the bus or riding my bike around. You. You are, you are such a fuck, you know that? No! No, you know what, I'm out of here. I can't do it anymore, all right? I can't even stay here. So, do you want to rob banks now? I'm not saying I want to rob banks. I'm just illustrating that if we did, it would be a lot easier than what we've been doing. So you don't want to be a bank? No. You all end up down the same road anyway. Either dead or 720. Isn't there no liquor stores? What are we talking about? Yeah, no more liquor stores. Besides, it's not the gig that it used to be. Too many foreigners own liquor stores. Vietnamese, Koreans. You can't fucking speak English. You can't empty out the bloody register. You don't know what the fuck it means. Right. You make it too personal. We go on. One of these goop motherfuckers gonna make us kill him. I'm not gonna kill anybody. I don't kill anybody either. They'll probably put us in a situation where it's either us or them. And if it's not the goops, it's these old fucking Jews who've only stole 15 fucking generations. You got Grandpa Irvin sitting behind the counter with a fucking magnum in his hand. Try to walk into one of those stores with nothing but fancy, see how far it gets you. Fuck it. Forget it. We're out of it. Well, what else is there? Day jobs? Not this fucking life. Well, what then? 